Everyone seems to agree property tax relief is needed in Texas, but there's a big disagreement on how to do it. And now it's causing a rift between not only the Texas House and Senate, but also the governor and lieutenant governor. The special session was called to finally reach a deal on property tax relief. And after just two days, the House passed their version of the bill, then adjourned for the session. That amounts to them saying they are done and telling the Senate to take it or leave it, much to the chagrin of Lieutenant Governor Dan Patrick. First, let's compare the House and Senate versions of the bill. The House version would devote $12.3 billion to lowering the school property tax, and that would benefit owners of commercial property and rental home investors in addition to homeowners who live in their home. The Senate version would take $12.1 billion and increase the homestead exemption to $100,000. This proposal would concentrate most of the benefit on homeowners more so than businesses and investors. Governor Greg Abbott has picked a side and he supports the House version, saying it's the only chamber that passed a tax cut bill germane to the special session and he looks forward to signing it. That did not sit well with Dan Patrick, who presides over the Senate. He tweeted a lengthy statement last night saying Abbott is misinformed about the roles of the branches of government. So basically telling the governor to stay in his lane. Patrick also criticized the House for adjourning, saying while they've thrown in the towel, the Senate continues to work. I'm Chris Sadegui. Now back to you.